Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new here. Thank you for stopping by. We are starting off this mini with one coat of UNT Pill Base. And I was just showing you a little preview of my right hand. That is what we're going to be doing on the left. All the dips and liquids today are from Simply Rose Custom Dips. So I will be going in with Truffle, which is a beautiful shimmery um, brown color. We're going to be doing two coats of that on every nail except for my ring finger. I only do one layer of truffle on that and then I do a layer of the glitter dip on top of that. So I'm going to let you guys just watch for a little bit and I'll be back.
on my glitter nail, I am doing one layer of Pop the Bubbly. And since I have been doing it this way with one layer of just a normal color and then only one layer of the um, glitter, it has helped a lot with my bulkiness of my glitter or party nails. So thank you to Sarah from Princess Sparkle Nails for uh, helping me out with that little tip because it has been working wonders since I started doing that. While you're watching me clear encapsulate I wanted to also just give you an update on these liquids on my first impression video I did mention that I had a hard time getting thin layers which did cause me to need um, more filing and buffing than what I'm used to however I am happy to report back that I did finally um, figure out you know the correct amount that I should be leaving on my brush to get a very thin layer and I didn't have to get out my e-file at all after this um, I will show you later in the video I think while my top coat is drying the files that I did use but all I had to do was um, basically just shape and then I did just lightly buff the top as I always do but the cuticle line was fine. I didn't even have to go around the cuticle line like I normally have to do. So I'm very happy that I figured out, you know, just the right amount that um, I needed on my brush to get those thin layers. So highly recommend these liquids if you're in the market for new liquids. Um, now I am using clear jars um, that these liquids are in, but she has since I think changed the um, bottles that her liquids are in so if you do order them your bottles might be different than the ones that I'm using but it is going to be the same amazing product on the inside As always, after filing and buffing, I always cleanse my nails with the Risen Legacy Nail Cleanser. So I'm going to do that and go ahead and apply my second coat of activator. Wiping with the alcohol just helps 
to get any remaining activator off to prevent my brush and top coat um, from getting contaminated from the activator. And here I am just going to show you the files that I used. So to shape, I used the Risen Legacy Nail File and then to buff, I just used the um, little orange buffer block that I got off of Amazon and I will have everything linked for you below. And for my cuticle oil, I am using my favorite um, cuticle oil from Candy Skincare and Poolside Ice is my absolute favorite scent. So I hope you guys enjoyed this Manny. If you did, please give me a thumbs up and consider subscribing so you don't miss any future uploads from me. I hope you have a good week and I will see you next time. Bye y'all.